Okay, you're looking at the Stratogeezer cart with the revised lowered jack shaft and smaller sprocket. So, with the jack shaft, I used to have, I'll just set this out here. This assembly, which hiked everything up quite a bit more, and uh, these brackets are the ones that come when you buy a jack shaft and the bearings that came with it, one of them actually seized up because they were not very heavy duty and because it wasn't mounted uh, exactly in alignment so it burned one of them up. So what I did is got some uh, industrial strength pillow bearings, they're about 25 bucks each, not cheap, but um, they allow for some play uh, for that jack shaft to uh, self-align, and um, in case I don't get it exactly right, and they're certainly not going to burn up like the other one did. So, uh, anyway, let me crank this thing up and I'll show you what it looks like running. other things I did is I raised up that gas tank uh, because it was interfering the, with that suspension in the back. Every time it bounced up and down it would um, shove the fuel line into the bottom of the gas tank so I needed to raise that up. So now I have a two foot fuel line on there and uh, it's not interfering with anything. That gas tank though actually touches my shoulder when I'm when I'm driving it so that's a little bit weird but I'm not exactly afraid about it exploding <laughs> <laughs> 